As for the El Paso Chihuahuas, the dogs getting back in the win column last night at the downtown ballpark against Reno, looking to get out of town with a win tonight. Same two teams tonight and uh, pretty similar start to the game. Two on for Francisco Mejia, who lines an RBI double down the right field line. That got the scoring started. Later in the inning, it's Matthew Batten at the plate. He's going to give this one to the ride to the opposite field off the foul pole. That right there, my friends, is a two-run home run. That made it 4-0 Chihuahuas. It was plenty of run support for Logan Allen, who was masterful. Seven innings, three hits, one run, ten strikeouts. Chihuahuas get the win 4-1. to one. They're at Fresno tomorrow night. Now, as of late, we've seen a lot of movement up and down, up and down between the Chihuahuas and their parent club, the San Diego Padres. That trend continued again today. Josh Naylor getting called up to the big leagues. He becomes the... 55th player to play for the Chihuahuas and then make his major league debut. That number to me is staggering in five plus years. Naylor joined the Padres in his homeland of Canada. Special for him and special for Chihuahuas manager Edwin Rodriguez, who has a lot of history with Naylor. I feel like Naylor is part of the family for me. I mean, it was, uh, I got it my first year that I came in in the organization, uh, 2017. I managed him in Lake Arsenal, and we were very close. He was only 19 back then. Seeing uh, a, a young player like Josh Naylor coming up and working as hard as he's been working and getting the call at such an early age. Naylor went 0 for 4 in his debut tonight in Toronto, so. Still looking for that first big league hit, but he'll likely be in the lineup at the DH spot all series long.